The Green Children of Woolpit It is the name given to two children whose skin has a strange color. It was reported that they appeared in the village of Woolpit in Suffolk in England sometime in the 12th century, perhaps during the reign of King Stephen. The two children are a brother and his sister, their appearance is normal except for skin color. These two children speak an unknown language, and they only eat green beans. Recently, however, the two children became accustomed to eating other kinds of food, and the paleness of their faces disappeared, except that the boy fell ill and died shortly after his baptism. The girl had adapted to her new life, but her behavior was liberal and reckless. After learning to speak English, the girl said that she and her brother had come from Martin's Land, one of the netherworlds with its green-skinned inhabitants. The story of the two children occurs in the near contemporary time around 1189 and 1220, in the Chronicum Anglicanum of Ralph of Cogshaw and Historia Reram Anglicum of William of Newburgh, respectively. From that time until their rediscovery in the mid-19th century the two children are only mentioned in the fictional book The Man in the Moon by Bishop Francis Godwin, in which William of Newburgh's report is mentioned. In an attempt to explain the story of the two colored children, two approaches have dominated the process of interpretation, either this story is a folk art story that describes an encounter with the inhabitants of another world that lies beneath our feet or even beyond the earth, or it is a distortion or distortion of a historical event. The English poet and critic Herbert Reed, an anarchist, said in his work English Prostyle, published in 1931, that the story was a perfect work of fiction. It was his inspiration for his only novel, The Green Child, written in 1931. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe.